Hello there, welcome to another video with me, Dan the Gaming Man. Today we're going to be taking a look again at Fanatical. I've actually done a video on Fanatical before. It's one of the first videos I ever did and I'll put a card to that in the top right corner for anybody that wants to check that out. But what we're going to do today though is we're going to look at another mystery bundle that they've set up. You can see here on the screen golden eggs with $1,000 worth of games to be found. So if we have a quick look at the bundle, what you can see here is in UK money for $13.99. There is 20 mystery eggs. So there'll be 20 different games, possibly a AAA game. We're gonna find out if we can get one. But I want to suggest as well that you stick around to the very end because I'm actually gonna be doing a raffle, which means that you lucky viewers have an opportunity to win these prizes. I'll go into a lot more detail about that at the end of the video, so stick around. But before we talk about any of that, let's find out what the games are that we're going to get in this mystery bundle and then see if they are worth paying £13.99 for. This time I'm going to use an Excel spreadsheet, yes, an Excel spreadsheet, to keep track of how much each game's worth when we have a quick look at Steam, because what you get on this is Steam Key, so that's where you're going to get the games from. So we'll check the value of them against what we've paid. And as I said at the very end of the video, I will talk about how you can win these games for yourself. So after making your purchase, you will be presented with this screen mystery egg bundle cracking games to be found in every egg with the mystery egg bundle. How exciting! Sorry, there's going to be a lot of puns like that, I'm sure. So what we do here is we can click open your eggs. And there we go. Here they come. This time it's presenting us with all of the eggs straight away, which I've not <laughs> seen it done like this before. Some interesting games coming up. One or two I do recognise. Not exactly how it was done last time. Last time we opened one at a time, but <laughs> there you go. So you go, the last one we have there is Out of the Box, which has come out of the egg. So let's have a look at each one. So we'll start with the first one that we got which was called Who's Your Daddy? So we'll go and have a look now at Steam. Okay this game looks a bit random, <laughs> it's quite a strange one. It says it's two games in one, um, you can see possibly playing as a child, uh, maybe both games you play as a child or possibly the daddy. Uh, it's 5 89 so not the most um, expensive of games. Probably not value for money, really. It's from 2015. Okay, so that's our first game. The second one we've got here is called Blind Fate Edo Niami. So let's have a quick look what that game's about. So this is described as being a hardcore cyber samurai game set in a post-apocalyptic Japan. So it does look quite interesting, we can see in the pictures. Um, so if that's something that appeals to you, then let me know in the comments. We can see that the price usually is £19.49, but at the moment they've got a sale on and it's £4.87. So I'm going to put the original price, which is £19.49. So the third game we got was called Doorways Holy Mountains of Flesh. Sounds terrifying, doesn't it? Let's have a quick look on Steam. So we can see this one is, as I suspected, an immersive horror adventure seems to be set in hell. That looks quite terrifying. <laughs> so if you like this kind of thing, then this one is worth £16.75. We've got three games and it's obviously already surpassed the amount that we have paid. So the question I always ask, is the Fanatical bundle worth it? And this would suggest that it is, as long as you're into these kind of games, of course. The next game we have here is called Search Party. Again, looks like some kind of horror game. I'd be surprised if it's anything other than horror, but let's have a look. Maybe 
we'll be surprised. So it says that Search Party came out in 2021 and you can see it has a sort of 16-bit art style. Quite intriguing, so not a, a terrifying horror game, but certainly intriguing one. It's £3.99, so not the most expensive game so far. Next up we have an interesting one. This one is called The Sexy Brutale. So <laughs> when we opened the last Fanatical Bundle, we got a very interesting game, My Summer Adventure, I think it was called. And no, I haven't played it, honest. This game though, sounds like it might be some kind of erotic game. Uh, let's have a, a check. The Sexy Brutale, a never-ending masked ball featuring intrigue, murder, and quite possibly the occult. So you can see here, it's got a very interesting art style. I quite like the look of this one, actually. Quite intriguing indeed. So this one is worth $14.99. The next game is called Black Hole. Again, potentially we've got a horror game here. Let's check. So this game looks like it's a, a 2D platformer, which looks like a lot of fun actually. Released in 2015, it looks like you play some kind of spaceman. It says that it's a story-driven sci-fi comedy and gravity-twisting puzzles. This one is worth £7.49. Next up we have a game called Swine. S-W-I-N-E -E, and it's the HD remaster. Fan fantastic, exactly what I wanted. I didn't want the standard edition, I had to have the HD remaster and that's what we've got, thankfully. Let's have a quick look though and see what it's worth on Steam. <laughs> so this game is currently on sale for £1.79 and it's usually £8.99. That's what I'm gonna put on the Excel spreadsheet, but you can see here, it's a little bit different to what we've seen so far. It looks a bit like a strategy game, doesn't it? Let's see what it says here. It says it's the new edition of the challenging classic strategy game. The filthiest of all wars between the rabbit and the pig armies is a sophisticated real-time strategy with completely revised textures. There you go, something quite different. We didn't have anything like this when we previously did a fanatical opening and once again, we've got something a little bit different. Once again, I will put the original price into the spreadsheet. I've lost count what game number we're on, but the next one is in between. So again, we'll have a quick check on Steam and see how much that's worth. Well, this game is also on sale at the moment. It's 89 pence <laughs> or 8.99 usually. It says it's set inside the mind of a man hit by a cruel twist of fate. It looks a bit like a platformer and it's got a very interesting art style. It's something that's quite appealing visually. So that could be a good game. $8.99, that's what's going on the spreadsheet. The next game we have is called Habsala. Not one I've heard of either. This one says Into the Soul Palace. So this one's a puzzle game with rich storytelling full of historical references. So I think if you're into those kind of games like The Room, like those kind of mobile games, this might appeal to you. It's fairly new as well, it came out in 2022 and it's worth $9.29. Next we have Zombie Army Trilogy. This is one of the games that I do recognise, one of the very few games that I recognise <laughs> um, on this list. So let's have a quick check though on Steam and find out a bit more about it. This game makes the bundle worth the price um, in my opinion because it's actually $29.99 this is the closest that we're going to get to a AAA game this one's a cult horror shooter series and what you've got here is the trilogy so yeah this one seems to be the best game that we've opened so far okay I'm not sure what's happened we've seemed to have lost that lovely screen that we had of all the games being presented so we're going to continue looking at what we've got so this one next is a beautiful desolation so we're going to have a look at steam so this one has a really nice look to it it's quite cool i mean that is a 
pretty <laughs> eerie image, isn't it? But yeah, this one looks pretty cool. Uh, it says that Beautiful Desolation is an isometric point and click adventure game set in a post-apocalyptic future. And this one is worth $10.99. Next we have a game called Kaichu. I think that's how I'm pronouncing it. It says it's a dating sim. This one has a, a cutesy art style. If you're into dating sims, which I'm not, then this one might appeal to you. It came out in 2022 and is actually worth $7.19. This next one looks interesting, doesn't it? Actung Cthulhu Tactics. Let's have a quick look at this one. So this game is worth $19.99. You can see it came out a few years ago in 2018. It looks like it has some turn-based combat. If you're a big fan of Lovecraft and possibly Adolf Hitler, then this game might appeal to you. It's got mostly positive reviews and it looks pretty interesting, pretty cool. The next game on our list is Autonauts. It's a game that I have heard of and you can see that it's got a colorful aesthetic. This one has very positive reviews. It's developed by Denki. It's worth £15.99. If you're into these kind of relaxing, casual games, then this one might appeal to you. When you consider how much you pay for the bundle, if this is a game that would appeal to you, then you're obviously making money back in a way. Next, we've got Hero of the Kingdom of the Lost Tales 2. So this one actually came out in 2021, but as we can see from looking at the screenshots, this is a game that wouldn't have looked out of place in the 90s, especially those strategy games that were popular, like, like Settlers and Age of Empires. This one's worth £5.89. Next up, we've got a game called Interrogation. You will be deceived. It looks quite scary, but let's check out Steam and see what it's about. This game's currently on an 80% sale. It's £2.59, usually £12.99. It says, as a police detective tasked with bringing down a dangerous terrorist group, you fight on two fronts, interrogating suspects and managing your team and its reputation. I really like the look of this one. I might consider picking it up myself in the sale. As I mentioned before, I won't be keeping any of these Steam keys. I'm going to be making these available in a raffle. So stick around for more information about that later on. Another detective game, a frog detective game. This one is called The Haunted Island. Will it be as scary as that? Well, haunted, quite possibly. Uh, but the image here suggests probably not. Scrolling down, I can see that this is available uh, as part of a trilogy that you can pick up in a bundle if this one appeals to you. Uh, but it's £4.29 on its own and has quite a, a nice style. It reminds me a little bit of Doan County. Next one we have is Rebel Galaxy Outlaw. Now I've actually got this or one of the other Rebel Galaxy games in a previous fanatical bundle that I've opened. So this is one that I think will be quite good from what I remember. Well, this is another game that's quite pricey, coming in at £23.79. It says, out of cash, out of luck, out on the fringe, Juno Markev has a killer to tail, a debt to pay, and more trouble headed her way. So this one has got mixed reviews. It's from 2020, but it looks quite intriguing. So this one might be worth picking up. We're down to the last two games. Next up is Hellstruck rage with your friends the arsenal of this one is quite interesting it looks like a cross between uh, castlevania and maybe shovel knight uh, it's from 2022 the reviews are mostly positive or very positive um, it's usually worth 6.99 but at the moment it's four pound 54 it's on a sale and it says get ready to rage with your friends in this co-op precise platforming adventure you're stuck in hell you can only jump upwards and all you have to do is escape. Can't be that hard, right? And the final game we have here is Out of the Box. This one I actually own on Switch, so I'm quite familiar with this one. I have played it for a few hours. So again, art style wise, this one looks pretty cool, doesn't it? It's one of those games you can sit back and play and kind of chill out with. It's from 2018. It's a game where you've got to make decisions. I think you play a bouncer outside a nightclub, which I think is called The Box and you've got to decide which people you let in and after each evening something crazy will happen. It's usually worth £11.99. So now we're going to look at the Excel spreadsheet and we're going to answer the question, is the Fanatical Mystery Bundle worth it? So firstly we have to remember we paid £13.99 for 20 eggs <laughs> and 
well, one egg and it opened and, and revealed all the games in one go. So not as fun as last time, but whatever, I'm over it. <laughs> Let's have a look at the, the games that we've got. The standout game is the Zombie Army Trilogy, which came in at $29.99. Another one of interest is Rebel Galaxy Outlaw, which was $23.79. And also Blind Fate Edo no Yami, which was £19. That's 49 and Actung Cthulhu Tactics, which was $19.99. So if you just take those four games into account, you're already at about £100, which shows that there is value in these mystery bundles. Of course, it's a gamble. You don't know what you're gonna get. So you're taking that gamble and possibly you get 20 keys and you're not interested in any of them. Fortunately, we've got some great keys here, I think. Now let's see the total value, £245.96. So if we go back to that question, is the mystery bundle worth it? Well, yes, it sort of is, isn't it? Because you've paid £13.99, we've got almost £250 worth of games, 20 games. And of course, if you get the keys, you can share them with your friends. Quite often with the humble bundle, me and my friends would share. So why not do it with this? Buy the bundle and then give out the keys that you don't want to friends. It's also a great way of building your library if you've got a Steam Deck or if you're just new to Steam in general. So you might be wondering, why have we got these different colours? Well, this is the exciting part. What I'm going to do is I'm going to give these games to three lucky winners. If you have a look at the description of this video down below, you will see a link to a website called Raffle. Raffle is a competition website. And you can buy a ticket for a raffle to win these games. Tickets will cost £1 each. However, if you buy five tickets, you'll get 10 for free. And if you buy 10 tickets, you'll get 20 for free. So pretty cool, right? And how I'm going to do it with the prizes is first prize will get the first 10 games. Games 1 to 10, I will send you those 10 Steam keys. There'll also be two runners-up prizes who will win five Steam keys each. So all you have to do is click on the link in the description to the raffle website, buy yourself a ticket for just one pound or possibly more. And not only have you got an opportunity to win some fantastic games, but also you'll be supporting the channel and that would mean so much to me. I can assure you the money from the raffle will be reinvested into this channel. So why not have a go? You've got to be in it to win it. So that's it, this is the end of the video. Uh, I apologise for my voice, I've got a bit of a sore throat at the moment, but I hope that you've still enjoyed this one. If you have enjoyed the video, give me a like and consider subscribing to the channel. I've just hit 1,000 subscribers, which I'm so happy about. I set up the channel five months ago and I can't believe how far we've come in that short time. So I really appreciate everyone that has hit that subscribe button. So for those of you who haven't, please do so, it means a lot to me. Until next time, stay safe and keep gaming.